Welcome, Jakob. It's Thank nice you. to have you here. What are your first thoughts about uh, coming to Rapid? Yeah, first of all, I want to thank you, Rapid, for a warming welcome, and uh, I'm really happy to be to be here and to be part of this amazing club. And uh, yeah, we have uh, the biggest goals, and uh, we want to make uh, history. We want to try uh, to win what is possible to win, and uh, yeah, I'm happy to be part of this club. And I hope to see the fans and uh, everybody as soon as possible, yeah. Tell me what made you choose uh, Rapid, coming from uh, Slavia, a big club from Czechia. Yeah, I was already six and a half years in Slavia and uh, yeah, it was really, really nice period of my career that we played all the season uh, Europa League or Champions League or Conference League, so all the seasons in Europe and uh, nice games and also uh, big stadium and amazing atmosphere every 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 game. So uh, it was not easy to leave the club like Slavia is, but uh, I felt almost uh, last six months I felt that uh, I lost my position in the team and I wanted to play and still I I hope I'm still young. I'm 27, so uh, yeah, I uh, I felt that I need some change and I need to change uh, maybe the country also, not just uh, the club. And uh, at the end of the transfer window, uh, my agent called me about uh, about Rapid, what I think, you know, and uh, I was like, at the first moment, I was like, I have no idea about Romanian football, about the club, you know, but. I was taking some uh, information from uh, the Romanian uh, football players or from uh, the Slovakian football players who are playing or who played in uh, Romania and all of them, they told me just positive, positive things uh, about the club, about the city, you know, so after that was easy decision and in 40, 48 hours, in two days was everything uh, done deal, so I'm here and I'm, I'm very happy. You made a good decision. But I want to ask you if you remember uh, a friendly game with Rapid. Yeah. Like two years ago. Yeah, I think it was uh, one and a half year ago when, uh, okay. in Austria in training camp. Played? I played that game. I played that game. I remember that. Yeah, we won like kind of. It doesn't uh, matter the score. Yeah, we won. <laughs> yeah, we won that game and. Uh, yeah, then that moment one Slovak guy went to play for for Rapid, you know. So I got some information about about it, but uh, yeah, it was a long time ago, and I I know the philosophy. I know the they explained me the the philosophy and the project of this this club, and uh, you did uh, amazing job last two three years, and uh, it's pleasure for me to be part of of this project, and uh, hope to help uh, hope to help the team. Uh, as much I can, and uh, hope to reach the title maybe at the end of the and the end of the season. That is uh, our goal, and we dream about about it. And uh, yeah, last two years I didn't win the title in uh, Czech Republic with Slavia, so I hope that third year in a row will be the opposite. And uh, yeah, we will do our, we will do our our 100 percent. We will put 100 percent. We will do our best and. We hope to be success. We have, hope to have success at the end of the season. Yeah. Do you have any uh, personal goals, like being a midfielder? I don't know. Maybe giving a number of assists. Uh, know, yeah. To goals. be honest, uh, to be honest, I'm not kind of player that uh, has a lot of assists or goals. Uh, to be honest, for me, uh, I'm maybe more happy when the team uh, has clean sheet after the game and. Uh, the opponent club uh, has zero shots in on the goal, so that's that's my work. That's uh, why I came here, and I want to help the the team, of course, also in the offensive offensive zone. And uh, yeah, but uh, this is not like how to say. I didn't score a lot of goals in my career. I I prefer to don't receive goal from the opponent. Yeah, and help the defense. So yeah, I'm looking uh, for it. Yeah, it's still nice to, to score some goals or to make some assists, but the most important is it's three points at, at, at the end of the at the end of the game. So uh, yeah, I cannot tell you that I have some uh, personal goals. I have just the team goals that is the most important for me. And the team goal is try to winning the title, try to win every Sunday or every Saturday, and uh, at the end of the season be happy and the people on the stadium make them happy. 
how would you describe yourself in only one word as a football player? Just in one word, it's it's difficult, Or you three know. Three words. <laughs> uh, all the time, 100. I I'm trying to put all the time 100. To be honest, it's not important if I if I play good, if I don't play good, if the team play good. For me, the important thing is to win all the games and uh, to celebrate after the game with with the fans, because at the end nobody will remember how you played, uh, but everybody will remember if you win or you lose, you know. So yeah, if I have to describe myself in three words, it's 100% all the time. So uh, you spoke about the fans. Have you seen any uh, videos with our uh, crazy fans? Yeah. It's a crazy atmosphere here in Julesh. You'll see it. Yeah, uh, I saw some, some pictures, some videos. I cannot wait to, to see it. Uh, live this evening and uh, yeah uh, I saw that they're amazing so it's uh, it's a pleasure to play in front of this amazing fan so I hope that uh, as soon as possible I can go on the pitch and uh, show them myself and to celebrate after every game with them how is your uh, Italian uh, experience you were in Juventus in youth you said that before that you had a Romanian uh, teammate yeah How was that? How that influenced you, that uh, experience? It was a big step for me. I was just uh, 16, and uh, when you're 16, you are still uh, just a kid, you know. And uh, leaving uh, my family, leaving my house, leaving my friends was not easy. But uh, yeah, it, it was, I think, the most important period of my life. Not just about football, but uh, actually about uh, like personally, like. Uh, to growing my character things and stuff you know like for the personally was like uh, amazing amazing experience I learned a new language I uh, I knew a lot of nice people new culture and uh, at the end I was part of uh, top academy football academy so it was nice three years in uh, in Italy and uh, yeah it gave me a lot Uh, like a football player and uh, like uh, like a person. So you're a Slovakian international. You played in Euro, right, with, uh, with Slovakia. Do yeah. you think uh, this uh, transfer will uh, give you a push to the national team for the next uh, European Championship? Yeah, two years. Uh, two was years. that uh, your decision was based on? No, 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 no. To be honest, to national. To be honest, uh, it was not uh, the most important thing for me. The most important thi thing to be for me uh, was like uh, to change uh, the country, to change the club after seven and a half years in Czech Republic. You know, uh, I feel young. I feel uh, that I can I can do much better than I was uh, doing in Slavia last season. You know, I played uh, just uh, four or five games, and uh, I felt like uh, I need to change. And uh, to be honest, national team was not uh, so important for me. Of course. What do you think about it for the European Championship? I'm lying if I if I tell you them that I'm not thinking about it. Of course not. But uh, to be honest, for sure was not not my decision about national team. It's uh, it's a nice thing. I was part of the national team in the last Euro. I played uh, two from three games. Uh, last year was an amazing experience, and everybody wants to play for national team, and uh, everybody wants to be part of the national team because all the country is watching. You know, it's a, it's a pleasure. It's it's uh, really nice. But uh, for me now, the most important is to not to restart my career, but start to to try to play more. And uh, at the end of the season, we will see what will happen. You will play about. with Romania, you know. Yes, yeah, Slovakia is playing against Romania in the group stage, so How yeah. How do you see this match? Romania with Slovakia. I don't know. I, I played with the Niko Stanchu in Slavia, you know, and I know his qualities and I know something about Romanian national team, about some amazing players, so uh, yeah, I think it's open. Uh, there is also Belgium, so it will be hard to beat them for us and for Romania. But uh, yeah, just uh, I'm focused now 100% to wrap it and we will see what will happen after the season. I'm coming just on loan with an option, so 
I, I will try to put my best, I will try to make my maximum and uh, convince Rapid to pay the option and uh, to, to become the player of Rapid also next season, but uh, yeah, uh, we will see next month. So you said you were a teammate with uh, Stanchu. Do you know uh, any Romanian words? To be honest, no. <laughs> no, to <laughs> be honest, you? not. It's uh, it's kind of uh, funny because uh, you know the first words uh, from another language is you know usually just the bad words. But uh, to be honest, I don't know uh, some Romanian words. But I speak Italian, so uh, I heard some some similar words from a lot of a uh, lot of you guys. So uh, maybe maybe it will be not so not so difficult to after couple of months or I don't know, let's say three, four months to speak uh, something in Romanian, yeah. So tell me about you, uh, like three words that defines you as a person. How would you describe I don't know, yourself I'm now, uh, outside I'm, football? Yeah, I'm now, I'm now a familiar guy and I have a wife and I have a daughter that uh, she will be three years old in April. So I became to be a familiar guy. And uh, yeah, that that uh, that's the thing what makes me happy, you know, out outside of the pitch. And uh, yeah, I'm kind of calm, calm guy, and uh, I'm not I'm not anymore the 20 years old guy that uh, you know. So with the family and, and stuff, it's uh, everything different. And yeah, that's what I think about myself that I'm kind of calm guy and. Uh, I love I love to be between uh, a lot of people. I love to be I love to be with the people. I love to be with my friends, with uh, my teammates. You know, so yeah, I try to be a friend with uh, everything. I think that I had never some problems with nobody. You know, so I hope that also in Rapid it will be the same. So, do you have a nickname? Uh, I don't have actually a nickname, but everybody called me Kubo in Slovakia because uh, all Jakubs in Slovakia uh, they have this nickname let's say Kubo so but for me Jakub Kubo it doesn't matter you know so yeah so at the end uh, please look at the camera and uh, send a message to our uh, fans that are happy to have you here yeah hi rapid fans I'm Jakub Romada I'm coming coming from uh, Prague and uh, hope to see you soon and uh, I cannot wait to make my first minutes uh, with this amazing club and this amazing stadium.